What's going on guys, today we are going to create a simple login form in bb.net using uh, Visual Studio 2022 and Windows Form application. First of all, you need to have a couple of things installed in your system. That is the main thing, the Visual Studio 2022. If you don't know how to install and how to configure Visual Studio for your software development, I already created one video so you can uh, look at that. The link is in the description section. So let's do it. Open up Visual Studio 2022 and then click on and create new project and from here source source windows form bb and select that uh, windows form visual basic option click next and give the application name bb login form click next and then click on create it will take some time to create uh, your project because visual studio is a bulky id it takes some time to render. After rendering, close that output. Uh, expand it a little bit. I'll select your form and go to properties. Uh, you will see that properties windows or if you don't see, go to right click properties and change the text. This to login form. You can also change the background of this form also. Go to and uh, there you can see under appearance back color select that and here you can uh, see a variety of colors here I'm going to choose this one not this one a lighter one this one this look nice now uh, if you don't see this toolbox so go to view and then there you can see one option toolbox after clicking that you will uh, display here and from the toolbox drag and drop some controls like level two level one for username another for password two text box one for username obviously one for password and then one button now it is that a little bit so that it looks good on your screen Now select that button and go to properties again and change the text to login. By the way, you can also increase the font size of this uh, login art button. So go to property and then font and here choose to well a little bit nicer. You can also change the background color of this button also. Go to properties and back color there you can see. There you go. Now let's change the uh, button uh, font color again. Also, go to four color and here it's like this. Looking a little bit uh, nicer now. Now uh, select that labels and from the properties change the text to username and here. password and uh, press control from your keyboard and select that uh, another labels and go to properties and so that you can change the font at once and uh, you don't have to do individually there you go now drag and drop one picture box also so that you can display one picture here choose from local import and this one okay now size uh, zoom pretty nice looking pretty nice now select your text box and you have to change the variable name of the text box so that you can remember while you are uh, writing your code and here goes txt user and here goes txt pass now double click that login button so that it will automatically click the listening event of that button and here dim define on variable dream username is a string 
is equal to txt user dot text now oh, whatever in here dot text and dim password is a string but uh, go uh, before that go back and uh, select that password text box and go to properties and here you can see use system password character uh, by default it is false uh, change to true so that your password will hide uh, when uh, you run your program and it is a pretty nice practice txt you pass dot dot text and uh, because this is a simple login form we are not going to uh, connect this with our, our database so if username is equal to admin and password is equal to admin what we are going to do is then message box dot show login success and then comma this is the information and then message box button dot ok otherwise else what we can do is else message box dot so login error and same process this is error and here goes message box button dot ok simple that's it save that uh, by the way if you want to create a login form that is connected to database i already created one video you can uh, look at that also and uh, guys keep subscribing us because we have the target of 100k this year and now let's uh, run it and type username is admin and password is admin message should display login success if you enter the username and password other than uh, admin and admin login error so that's all uh, this is a simple uh, pretty straight forward tutorials uh, if you like this video share this video with your friends so that they can create a simple login form in bb.net and give thumbs up which really motivates us to create such programming video and stay connected with us and once again thank you for watching have a good day bye bye